again with another banger video today we're going to be targeting the famous carp the carp uh today we're going to be using the carp springs and carp leaders from lcd 956 uh this is a the bait that we're going to be using and this is the leader that we're going to be using these are the famous carp springs uh today we're here in little canal we're going to be trying to catch some carp uh showing you guys how to rig it up how to how i rig it up and how i use my my rod Today I'm gonna be using uh today I have my guard combos. I didn't bring uh my card brick combos, but they're still nice. Uh they're little four thousand reels with a nice little tiger rod. Today we're gonna be uh I'm gonna tie the the card spring um to demonstrate you guys how I pack my my rig, how I do it, how I do everything. I haven't casted out the line. This is my. This is gonna be my first time casting the line. Uh, I wanted to show you guys. I wanted to wait and show you guys how I do it. Um, first and nothing, I like to tie my knot. You can do whatever knot you like. Um, whatever knot you prefer. I just like using a regular simple knot. Uh, we have these small carp springs. We also have some big carp springs. These are the bigger ones. These are for uh, more bait. You fit more bait. Uh, I don't like you. I don't really like using those because uh, I just brought a little can of, of bait. I don't want to waste all my bait. But there you go. So what we're we gonna do? We're gonna get some carp bait. You see the little thing right here? We're gonna get some carp bait. We're gonna pack it real good, real good. We're gonna pack it, pack it where the spring is at. We're gonna pack it. It's gonna look something like this. And the little hooks in the bottoms, we're gonna wanna put some corn. Some magic corn. It's just, oh shit. It's just regular, regular corn. <laughs> uh, we're gonna be using some corn. I like uh, putting like two or three pieces on the, on every, on every corn. On every corn that I see, they were on every hook that I see. My bad. I like putting at least three corns on each. If it fits more, more. It's better for the better for the fish. Probably better luck if you put more. And bam! The shot it looked like. These are the famous. LCD carp rigs. Let's cast it up. I just found this dog right here. No water. People are crazy out here. Gotta get some water. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hopefully he doesn't bite. I don't think he bites. He has to be in the little shade. No, don't do that. No. Some water? Come on. Come on. 
You want some water? Come on. Drink some. Drink some. Good boy. Good boy. Damn, people are crazy out here. Good boy. Drink some water. Drink some water. Drink some water. And that is with a dog. I have one exactly like him, but mine has like some white little spots. Let me bring some more water. This is my last water I have for It's for the baby. Let me see, let me see. Wait. Get some water, get some water, get some water. It even catches you, tilapia. Woohoo! Now let's release this boy. Nicely and calmly. Let's release him back to his shelter. Oh shit. Nice little tilapia. It was biting, but. Uh, yeah, baby. We're hooked on. Hooked on. Oh, yeah. Oh, we'll get it back. I got it by the weight. I messed up, but we'll get it back. Back to back. Back to back guys. I lost all the other one, but I got another one. Ah, yeah, yeah. Look at this. Look at this bad boy. Look at this bad boy. Got hooked on twice. Look at this bad boy. LCD leaders never fail, baby. Look at this. I just got a nice little carp. I just released it. Um, I didn't record. I don't know why. I, I, I messed up on not release on not recording why I released it because I was so happy. But once again, this is how I rig it up. I put the bait in the spring. 
this is how it should look and then I get some corn get some canned corn put it in there boom boom I lost one and like two seconds late two five seconds later the other one was biting that was crazy that was crazy let's hope to get some more footage for you guys um, so this is how it's gonna be rigged up once again let me show you guys you could order these leaders at lcd956 baitandtaco.com this is how you rig it up boom it's ready to catch some carps baby <laughs> bent right now and I tried getting it but I didn't feel nothing so I left it there hopefully right now it bends again so hopefully right now I have something on that rod right there let me see what I got Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. I knew it. I knew it was gonna come back. I knew it. Ah, oh, got off, boys. It got off, but I'll get it right now. It just got off, but I'll get it right now. Let me see. This rod was moving also. It's my second one, second one of the day that gets off, but it's all good. I'm, I'm catching and releasing, so um, for me, I just came out to have fun, to record for you guys, because I have a lot of people at the store asking me about the car brakes, uh, for me to do another video, because I haven't done a video in a while, and these are the car brakes. Um, right now, let's hope to get another one for you guys, for the video, and fish on, guys. Oh yeah, baby. Ah, oh, he got off. He got off. We'll get it right now. Oh no, I got it. I got it. <laughs> it's a little nice tilapia. I thought I lost it because it was not that heavy, but it's a little nice tilapia. I get you some tilapia too. Let's release this bad boy into the water. Let's release the bad boy to the water again. All right, guys, so as you can see, I just lost two carps already. The thing that I'm doing wrong is I don't have a net. So I'm getting it from the mouth or I'm getting it for the weight. That's something you guys shouldn't do if you're trying to catch a carp carp, you know? Um, but like me, that I don't really, I'm catching and releasing, recording for you guys. Um, I didn't bring my net and anything. So I'm just getting it from the from the weight, from wherever I see the carp that I can get it from. Uh, so that's something you guys shouldn't do. Um, 
because the carps they have like this their heads they're really soft their mouth they're really soft so the hooks will come out easily and everything um the best thing you guys can do is get a net um i didn't bring one right now so i'm trying my best right now i got one i released it i got two but i lost it but i got it on video hopefully right now i'm gonna move the truck a little bit more more so you guys can see the action and everything i do it's pretty it's been pretty good i've been here for like an hour already and i already got three carbs um it's, it's something is something you know better than nothing <laughs> uh these are the all the carb bricks that we have these are bigger springs um these are bigger springs it holds more bait so um i was i wasn't using this one but i saw that there's a lot of action so uh i threw it right now i'm gonna test it again where there's more carbs um i found the honey hole where the carbs are at they're hiding they're chilling in the in the shade um i was throwing towards the sun but nah they like being in the shade i threw in the shade and i've been getting a lot of action so right now i'm gonna throw this one again i'm gonna throw it that direction i have one facing over there one in the middle and one on the other side just so we could have them spread out and everything uh let's throw this one let's see what we catch big shout out to mars he gave me this rod yesterday we're putting to use today Just lost a monster, guys. Oh no, it's still hooked on. It's still hooked on. Oh yeah, baby. It's fighting, guys. It's fighting. It's a monster. Oh shit. Hopefully I bring it for you guys. It's a monster. It's a monster car. Come this way, baby. Come this way, baby. Come this way. Come with daddy. Come with daddy. That is right here. And that's how you do it guys that's how you do it hell yeah look at nice look at this little nice little carp very orange beautiful beautiful carp you seen the carb rigs they work because they work as you guys can see it's moving pretty good hopefully we get something yeah it's moving let me put my phone over here Oh yeah. Uh, it's, it's a little tilapia. It's a little tilapia. As you guys can see, it works for everything, even for catfish. I use it for catfish. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. It's a nice little carp. Shit. It got off guys. As you guys can see it got off again. It was a nice little carp. Oh fuck, I should have brought my excuse the language. Should have brought my net. But it's all fun. It's I'm having fun. 
that's all that matters. I'm having fun. I'm out here chilling by myself in this little nice canal. Um, this little nice canal. I'm chilling like a villain. Ah. Uh, all right, you guys. Oh, shit. I forgot to release this little boy. <laughs> As you guys can see, I get too excited. Uh, I got this little boy. Let me release it. Oh. It fell by itself. <laughs> it fell off my hands and it went by itself inside. But hopefully I get more footage for you guys and catching the carp because this is the third time it gets off. But it's all fun. It's all good. It's all good. I just casted this one about two minutes ago and it's getting some nipples. I think it's a little tilapia again, but is it? Is it a tilapia or carp? Yeah, it's a little tilapia. As you can see, the tilapias, I bring them in like nothing. Um, that's because their mouth, their mouth, their mouth uh, are a little bit more, they're not softer. So you could pick them up and everything and they won't get off. As you can see this one, it's a little nice tilapia. Let's release this bad boy. As you guys can see, I have my little buddy. Um, I don't know whose it is, but he just came here next to us. He's just chilling. He's chilling next to me. I don't, I don't like seeing dogs like this, so I fed him. I didn't have food, I fed him some little corn. I gave him some water. And he's just there chilling with me next to me. I have a dog personally. It looks exactly like him and it sucks when people people do that i can't really do nothing about it because my dog is aggressive i have a pit bull blue nose and he's aggressive and and this is a male too so they won't get along but um hopefully someone rescues him because it's hot out here and people are messed up they just leave him like nothing they just leave him like there um i love puppies so I don't like I don't like seeing dogs like that. And yeah, guys, it's just here out here chilling, um, having some fun, just wasting some time. It just fucking bit me. It fucking bit me. Dogs are not. Dogs are not good. Those dogs are crazy. Whew. He wouldn't let go from me, so. I had to hit him. I didn't. I didn't want to hit him. I felt bad, but it bit me. As you guys can see, it's really bad. My hand. I don't feel it right now. I don't feel it, but it's all good. It's all good. He was just being protective out of me, but it's all good. We're good. He's good. Haha. <laughs> He's. He just. He just left over there. I didn't want him here next to me anymore, so I just tried moving him over there. But it's crazy. I was feeding him, he was next to me and everything. I was just trying to be nice and that's what I get <laughs> for being nice. Hopefully tomorrow or whenever I have a chance, I'll come back because I got bit by the pit bull really bad. And right now, I think I'm going to the hospital because it looked like he had like a uh, roña. I don't know how you call it in English, but he had roña and I need, I need to get myself checked because my hand, it hurts and it's numbed. I don't feel it, <laughs> but, but yeah, um, just whenever you're out there, if you see a dog, just don't try to feed him because you don't, you don't know how they are. Um, that, that was my mistake. I don't know how he was. Um, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully everything's good and, um, hopefully another day I'll come again and do another video for you guys, a longer video. I was planning on staying here for like another hour, but my hand, it's, it's hurting so bad right now. It's hurting bad. So I'm going to go get myself checked and yeah, guys, um, hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoy the video right now. There's a lot of action, a lot of action, but safety first um safe, safety has to always be first 
um, just be careful out there guys like I said um, just stay away from from animals <laughs> stay away from animals and yeah um, hope to see you guys in the next video thank you for watching I just got out the hospital. Um, it was a that was a pretty intense video today, cause that was a pretty long video today, um, cause I was I went fishing around five five p.m. and right now it's uh, one of four at night. Um, I got bit by the pit bull. It was a black pit bull. Um, as you guys can see, I was. I was feeding the dog, I was uh, giving him water and everything. Um, the only thing that I got too comfortable with the dog. Uh, don't ever get comfortable with no dogs, no whatever animal, don't ever get comfortable because it could go wrong. Um, what happened is uh, I was done, I was done uh, rigging up all the leaders and everything. I was just chilling, um, sitting down um, behind a... Uh, Oh, the dog was on the side of me he was sitting down next to me and I was gonna give him some more water because he was just there um, like he wanted some water so I was gonna give him water again and then I got my hand I got it too close to his mouth not close like wanted to get in, in my hand inside his mouth but um, I don't know he reacted and he got my hand he wouldn't let go so I started hitting him that's the only that's the only thing I could thought about it at the moment. Um, I was hitting him with my hand, no, with with the rod. Yeah, because I had a rod next to me that I wasn't using. Um, so I hit him with the rod, and that's when he started letting go to my from my hand. And as soon as I see my hand, it was covered in blood. So I wrapped up everything. I I I took off all my lines. I was like, it's it's over. Um, it's um, yeah, I, I'm not I'm not gonna fish anymore. Uh, and I talked to my girlfriend, and she was like, "Let's go to the hospital." I was like, "Just to get checked." And yeah, he did have rabies, um, so I got a shot. Um, they gave me a shot. I was there for a couple hours. They were checking up on me. On me, they gave me. Um, they protected my hand. They told me to to protect it for like the next three four days. To not to not get infection um so yeah um that's it for today's video guys um it was a pretty good pretty good um i was catching carbs and everything until until the dog messed everything up <laughs> but it's part of the game uh, i had fun i had fun um uh, fishing it just um yeah, just be careful whenever you guys are out there. Just don't um, don't ever let no dogs or whatever. Don't be comfortable with no pets or nothing, cause it could go very wrong. 
Um, so that will be it for today's video, guys. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the video. I'll be making another another video pretty soon. I'll be making a, another carp video because uh, uh, I didn't get to fish that much. I was there for like an hour, probably an hour and a half. And then I went to the hospital. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Um, much love to everyone. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and hope to see you in the next one. Thank you.